ProAction Cafe, just as the name implies, moves you more towards action. So basically, rather than just brainstorming, we're really brainstorming at this point with more of a purpose. I'm Phil. My question is, what does a sustainable community look like? So someone brings up a idea for a project or a question, and they go through a series really of three main questions around it. The first one is trying to identify what's really the quest behind the question. What's it really about? Uh, after they've talked about what the quest is, another group of people comes in and works with them, and that question is, what's missing? You know, what else about this do we need to know about this project or question? And then finally, they go into a point where they have a little bit of a time as, a, as the caller of the question or the project to really think about what have they learned about themselves through these conversations, what have they learned about their project, and also to think about what their next steps would be to start towards implementation. And then the group comes back in, actually another new group of two or three people, and they present that to them and then particularly get interaction. What help they still need to move that project or answer of that question forward? So I don't just sit at a table with the same five people for an hour getting their creativity. I might get sit at the table and three different groups will come to my table over the course of the hour, each sharing something in to the creative process. What excites me about it is um, for organizations that are already strategic, they know what they want to do, but this would be a way of some cross-pollination happening. And so with this ProAction Cafe, what it does is it allows people from different departments within an organization to have a say around what they think can take place in the organization. And then what happens is you have everyone in that organization owning every part of the organization. A person who cannot ask for help cannot be trusted. It works really well when a group of people needs to help each other out to make both going deep into what they're going to go and do, finding out the real deep meaning of it, and also then to make the robber hit the road. I am grateful for the questions you asked, uh, the ways in which you've challenged me, and um, it, it really brought together what I needed personally and professionally to really just challenge myself. The art of hosting process believes that people support the solutions they're part of creating. So it moves away from the expert model and into the, the solution exists within the room, the wisdom exists within the room. Part of that also is that because people support the things that they're part of creating, they own and take care of those things that they're part of creating.